Hi, I'm Lucas from The Rat Project and in this video I want to tell you a bit more about the Kickstarter. So it is a crowdfunding platform and for those of you who are not familiarized with the concept of crowdfunding, crowdfunding is a practice of funding a project or a venture by raising small amounts of money from a large number of people, typically via the internet. Actually from my point of view it's kind of like a pre-order, but there is a little hook that if we do not achieve the expected goal, the project does not get funded and everyone gets their money back. I mean, technically they do not get their money back because they will not give them in the first place. I'll tell you more about it a bit later. So when it comes to the Kickstarter page itself, in the top sector you can see a teaser for our game. You can also see the amount of money we have raised already, uh, the amount of money that is our goal, how many backers we actually have, and how many days there are left before the campaign ends. So then you have this bar with five tabs. The first one is the campaign. It contains extreme amount of information about our project. Then we have the frequently asked questions one. The third one is for the updates, where we, yeah, we just post the updates. Then there is a comment section, and the last tab is a community tab. So when it comes to the content of the story tab, the campaign one, uh, it contains general description of our game. There also are stretch goals. Stretch goals are additional thresholds for uh, amount of money that we need to achieve, like our next goal in the game. For example, the first uh, stretch goal to be achieved after uh, funding the game is to make a fully professional voiceover for all the characters in the game. So apart from that, in a story tab you can see plenty of things, starting from the demo in the description with the link to download it on Steam, through character art, some general idea of the storyline and the lore we will be, world we will, and the world we, lore we'll, Oh no! And the world we're building. Yeah, that one. There is also some information about the locations, as well as about the card combat system. Also, you can listen there to our soundtrack, see all the rewards, but we'll get there. All the social media, press kit, information about our team, something about the references and the inspirations we had while creating the magazine, a word about potential platforms. Also, there is information about how we are planning to distribute the budget if the game gets funded, as well as a word about our past and plans, followed by the risk and challenges analysis. So the system of pledges and rewards is very simple. Uh, you can pledge any amount of money, but from certain levels you get specific rewards. So the first pledge is kind of like blank one, because it's like back it because you believe in it. There is no reward there, it's just your pure intention of helping us to make the game. So the first pledge with the reward is the one for four pounds. And if you get that, you will get a Discord role like a proud backer because you know there is nothing better than eternal glory on the internet plus you will get a personalized thank you email it is an important thing to us that the whole thing is happening and we really would like to like thank you as much as we can so the second pledge is for 12 pounds and it actually contains the game you get a discord backer you get a thank you note and you get a digital copy of the game you get a steam key you can download the game once it's released so then there is a 16 pound pledge and on top of the previous rewards you get special dlc uh, that will contain an achievement of a kickstarter backer plus from now on your name will be in the credits another one is a 20 pound one it is a one for the music lovers because you get everything that was before plus access to all the compositions of the official soundtrack then we jump up to the 30 pound pledge this is like the patron of the digital arts because uh on top of everything before you will get the uh, digital art book and insight to the behind the scenes content which we are gonna run through probably discord channel and the newsletter the way you prefer and that concludes the digital rewards the basic tiers so the next one is 40 pound one where you get as usual everything so far plus the t-shirt and from this physical pledge the one with the t-shirt all of the following ones are gonna be limited so the next one is the art book for 80 pounds plus everything so far. It will contain not only concept arts or character arts with the descriptions or the locations, but it will also contain a short comic book story that will supplement the, the story that's, that's going to be delivered through game. And these were the physical pledges. So every pledge above will contain the t-shirt and the art book as well. And now we get to the in-game pledges, to the, to, the, to the big ones and very limited ones. So the first one is for £160. And what will happen is you will get your portrait in the game based on the photos you will send us. There are plenty of options of how you can actually appear in the game. It might be 
be on a beautiful painting, you know, like in a, in a castle, or you might be one of the participants in a syndicate party. I mean, there are plenty of options. And now we're getting to the like highly limited ones because there are going to be only three of those. This one will require a minimum pledge of 240 pounds, but you will get to design a character with us. What does it mean? It means actually that uh, we will need to have a fair amount of calls actually with me. We'll exchange ideas, we'll talk about it, we'll think about the things that makes this character interesting and we'll go through this whole creative process that is so important in this game. Another one is a 400 pound one. And in here you will get a design, the card with Hugin and Vin. Starting from the basic idea through the mechanics, its place in the deck. I don't want to tell you too much about it because for those special pledges, we're gonna make a separate videos to, to detail out what it's gonna be like and the higher pledges are like super limited because there is only one of each pledge from here. So with 800 pound one, you will be able to design a full location with us. And you might think that's the end, but no, there is one more, like 4,000 pounds. It's a, it's a supreme pledge. I mean, this is a pledge where we have to have a call first, uh, you know, like asking, so so what what do you want to do in this game? I mean, like, yeah, let, let's just find out. Let, let's have a talk and then let's settle out what's gonna happen. <laughs> when it comes to the payment itself, it's actually super simple. You just you just choose the reward, you, you click on it. If there are any physical items applied, then you have to choose where they are gonna be shipped to because we need to add the shipping cost. And then, yeah, by clicking continue to lead you to the form where you will have to do a payment with card. And the thing about and the thing about the Kickstarter is that they will not take money from your account until the campaign is fully funded. That was the thing I was talking before that you actually do not pay the money now and you get it back if the campaign is unsuccessful. It's rather you will just not pay the money if the campaign is going to be unsuccessful. So I think that will be it and thank you for watching and 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 see you next time I guess. Thank you. Cheers.